There's no denying one of dog's most defining traits is their loyalty. After all, they are not called man's best friend for nothing. A basic reason for their loyalty would be we provide them with food and shelter. Yet, if we dig deeper, science can provide some clues as to why. Here are three scientific reasons that explain why dogs are so loyal. Dogs, like their wolf ancestors, are pack animals to the core. For packs to survive, members must cooperate and be loyal to each other. So putting the pack's interests first is part of a canine psychology. This would explain many cases of dogs risking their lives to protect their owner. A 2009 study by Russian geneticists concluded the genes of domesticated dogs have been influenced over time as well. It suggested friendly proto-dogs were reproduced to ingrain tameability in subsequent generations. This is backed by a 2014 research conducted by the University of Vienna, which also unearthed something interesting. Essentially they found that while wolves cooperate, dogs, on the other hand, submit. As wolves became dogs, the study proposed they were also bred for dependence on human masters and the ability to follow orders. This brings us to the next point. Long-term domestication soon resulted in hundreds of different dog breeds. Even to this day, dogs have been bred for various tasks, from sitting on laps to working outdoors. As such, they've undergone drastic behavioral and physical changes, depending on qualities desired by breeders. Some were bred to always depend on human guidance, and in doing so forged strong emotional bonds with their owner. Examples include dogs originally bred for hunting, who had to look to their masters for cues. On the other hand, some dogs had this dependency unwittingly reduced. Examples include herding and rescue breeds renowned for their ability to concentrate and solve problems. Then again, dependency is different for individual dogs and should never be an indicator of their loyalty. So what makes a dog loyal regardless of breed? Apart from pack instincts, there's something else at play as well. was conducted where dogs were presented with sense of their owner, food, and a stranger. Brain scans were taken of the dogs as they approached each scent. The findings, published in Science Direct in 2005, showed dogs reacting positively to the scent of their owner, over that of food and a stranger. In addition, the part of their brain associated with enjoyment and positive emotions released oxytocin when given their owner's scent. In a human, such brain patterns would be associated with feelings of love. Dogs identify so strongly with us that they've also picked up our modes of communication, like locking eyes. Locking eyes, as well as petting and talking, also increase oxytocin levels in both humans and dogs. In another experiment conducted in 2015 by the University of Kyoto, dogs watched a stranger act rudely to their respective owners. When allowed later to interact with the stranger and their owner, the dogs actively snubbed the stranger. Well, if that's not love, then loyalty is the next best explanation. So that's the science behind the unbreakable friendship between humans and dogs. If your dog is your best buddy, you're part of an ongoing story going back millenniums. Do also remember each dog is an individual 
whose personality is shaped by personal history. Whether a dog behaves lovingly or not does not influence its loyalty. In the end, what counts in enduring friendship are mutual feelings of trust. Thanks for watching. If you have found this video useful, hit the like button and subscribe for new content weekly.